Hello and welcome to the NewTek TriCaster TC1 Get Started Training. In this video, we're going to show you how to set up your live video inputs to use in your productions. So here we are in our TC1 live production interface and you'll see that I have my 16 live video signals coming through and each input I can configure by clicking on the gear icon in the bottom right corner of each preview monitor window. Clicking on that, under the source, I can then select any source available to me. We're going to check out our local sources, which are going to correspond to the SDI inputs on the back. So now I'm bringing in a live SDI video source, which I can then adjust the format if necessary, and also adjust the video delay if I need to as well. And from the name and comment menu, I can then change the name of the video input bringing in, or even reassign the label on my switcher to anything I want it to be. Now going back to our source, under this drop-down, any input can also be used as an NDI source. So these are all of the devices that are broadcasting via NDI over my network, and each of these inputs correspond to the different video signals coming from that device. So I can select any of these sources to bring into my production over the network. Now we also have a PTZ control section here, so if this was a PTZ camera, I could go through and select which protocol I would want to choose to control my camera with. Now next we have our image tab at the top here, and this is where we can go to do auto color correction, select our and make adjustments to our proc amp, also set up our live mat, and crop the source as we need to. Now we also have a tab to set up automation to apply to this input, but we'll go over that in another video. So now that we have our inputs set up, in the next video we're going to show you how to use those inputs and do some basic switcher operations.